Hello, my name is Yael, psychoanalyst from the Israel Psychoanalytic Society. I'm happy to present you shortly our going on project. The name of our project is Psychoanalysis in Peripheral Area in Crisis, Standing Up for Vulnerable Populations, Adapt a Therapist Project. We initiated the Adapt a Therapist Project about two years ago as an initiative to support the therapists who work in the public therapeutic frameworks in the South of Israel, as well as live in the South, therapists who work under the continuous burden of a precarious security situation and economic disparities. The members of the Israel Psychoanalytic Society have long been thinking about these disadvantaged groups, consists of Jews and Arabs, as well as about the entire South of Israel. And the trigger for action was felt during the 2021 Israel-Palestine crisis. As a part of this crisis, deadly missiles were fired daily from the Gaza Strip towards population all over Southern Israel. All parts of the population were affected by air raid sirens going off all day long. We felt that a professional response must be given to this population, get off the couch and connect with therapists working in difficult conditions of crisis. We thought that by establishing relationships with therapists living in the South themselves and caring for the population of the South, we would succeed in building a bridge between the center and the periphery. We decided to provide a professional envelope of psychoanalytically oriented supervision for these therapists, and we called our project Adapt a Therapist. As part of the project, we created diets of adapter and adapted, where the adapter is a psychoanalyst who volunteered for this project, and the adoptee is a psychotherapist from the South who is interested in psychoanalytically oriented supervision in order to help him thinking and holding his patients. We offered personal psychoanalytic supervision on Zoom. Today, the project also includes training groups, groups some of which are composed of Arab and Jewish therapists and others only of Arab therapists. We proposed this thinking that the therapists in the South are faced with demanding and ongoing therapeutic work in years of crisis and stress with very little retention and learning because there is still almost no psychoanalytic community in these areas, which are far from the center of the country. And for the Arab therapists in the South, the situation is even worse since they have almost no access at all to psychoanalytic learning. And we wanted to start thinking about these gaps and reduce them. More than 10% of all members of the psychoanalytic society in Israel volunteered to this ongoing project. And we received many responses from both, both sides of the adoption of deep gratitude. Thank you for listening.